Let's go ahead and load. Um, I just want to see what happens. So I got that baby. I want to see if I can do this first. And then, um, what is this? It's a headband. Alright. Karada, that's his name. Yeah, well, I gotta, uh, I don't want to touch it, you know, because he's gross, but I'm going to do it anyway. Nasty. I just want to, this is a living room. Where is this? <laughs> I am in someone's house. Well, uh, the screen is lit up. Yes, inspect it, see what's on there. I was satisfied at first, I enjoyed being loved by all, but suddenly it was all hollow. It wasn't me who everyone loved, it was my mask. Oh, you mean your serial killer mask? That one? How many girls have you killed, dude? Sorry, I'm just curious. There he is, do do do, walking down the hall. Mr. Karada's totally the best, a little mysterious, but that only makes him even better. Lucky Ayaka, having him for homeroom. Oh, no, that was Ayaka that was obsessed with him, not Saitomi. I, oh, I get the stupid girls mixed up because they're all dumb. I'm so jealous. <sighs> Mr. Karada, you're just so beautiful. He's got a great face. Way prettier than any of those boys. Come on. You no, know, you gotta keep walking by and act like, you know, that. and his personality is killer, too. Yeah, and so is his knife. His knife is also a killer, just an FYI. Totally. Kind and reliable. That's his biggest charm. He's not all appearance. Yes, he is. He has to keep his mask on because he likes to stab people for a living. Damn it. Everyone always goes on and on about appearance. So, if he had stayed there long enough to hear them still talking, he would have been like, Oh, they also like my personality. I see. He's just a fucking drama queen. Sorry. Those idiotic girls. This... This isn't my face. Yes, it's attached to you, so it's gotta be. Oh, oh, there's a guy in here now. I don't like it. I'm gonna get in bed and pretend like he's not here. Uh, hi, buddy. Oh. He disappeared. Found a yearbook. Aw, uh, he was like the little, like, skinny, scrawny kid. So he, like, made himself look, his appearance look better and stuff. Karata? This person, is it really Mr. Karata? Let's see, so he changed the way he looked so he would be liked by people more. Why do you even come to school, Karada? Oh, So awful. Ugh, it's Karada. I would be like, ugh, it's the bitches. Just you being here stinks up the glass. Go home, maggot. Jeez. You turn the weird kid into a serial killer. You're in the way. Move it. Okay, one, you were just standing over there. Whoa, that kid's got ninja moves. Sorry. Forget it. Just move. Go. Ugh. Ugh. Hey, she's crying. You're the worst, Karata, making girls cry. W was it my fault? You didn't move fast enough. But, yuck, pervert. Karata groped her. Awful. Wow! Hi, Takano. Whoever you are. Kids are awful. No one accepts me. So he changed his appearance so he could fit in better, and then he hated it? Is that Karata's past? Ah! No one accepts me. So he started killing people then. It's a kitty! Hello, kitty! Meow! Whoa, the cat is a teleporter to another dimension! Nice. Why? Why does everyone reject me? I hate it. I can't stand it. It's a cat. It's a kitty! Meow! Kitty cat! A cat? Yes, it's right there in the garbage. Did you not see? No. A cat? Is it a stray? It's wounded. You look so frail. I need to get you to a hospital. Hang in there. I'm going to help you. I'm sorry, but she's beyond saving. No. Aw. 
Kitty died. I'm sorry. If only I had found you sooner, maybe I could have helped you. How sad. Of course, I can't really say that him choosing to murder girls, or at least a girl, was entirely everyone else's fault. Yes, he was bullied, he was picked on, he was hurt, but he did choose to kill somebody. No one ever accept accepts me. That's what I thought. But she was different. You really gonna eat in a place like this? Loser. This dump is the perfect place for Karada, huh? <laughs> you said it. Hey, say something. You're lame. Let's go. <sighs> hey, it's a chick. What up, Miss Green Hair? Anime protagonist. Are you okay? Takano? Do you mind if I sit with you? Huh? It's okay if you don't want me. Sorry. No, nothing like that. So I can? Yeah. What do I do? What do I say? Takano's not saying anything either. Why did Takano talk to me? Uh, Takano's hands are so pretty. Hey, do you always eat lunch here? Uh, yeah. I see. It's nice here. It's quiet and calming. Yeah, I guess it is. Yeah. Sorry. What is it? I couldn't do anything when you were being teased. Don't. Hey, can I come again tomorrow? Uh, we should eat lunch together from now on. Huh? You, if you eat with me, you'll just be teased. I don't mind at all. I've decided I won't back down. I was feigning ignorance out of fear. I always turned away from reality, but I'm going to stop. From now on, I'll protect you, Karada. What? Am I bothering you? No, that is, you're not, but, but... It's surely... you can't. If you got teased because of me, I... I mean, I'd feel guilty. And having a girl protecting me, I'll just be teased more. I guess so. I'm sorry. Uh, but I really appreciate the thought. Well, sorry for bringing it up. No, it's... Still, it won't change that I want to protect you, Karada. Come to me anytime you're in trouble. I'll help you with anything. Takano. Thank you. Hey, I want to know you better, Karada. She's got the hots for you, man. She was the first. The first to accept me. I was so, so happy. Something bad happened, didn't it? Like, she died or some shit. We met there every day afterward. We didn't talk to each other. We just spent the time together. Conversation wasn't necessary. My heart was at ease with her there. We were happy. Ah, that cloud looks like a sheep. So it does. It's cute. Yeah. Takano's smiling. She's cute too. I loved her hands and her voice and her smile. I fell for her. My first love. I feel like something really bad is going to happen to her, so, you know, be prepared. I... I love Takano. Yes, I do. I really do. I love her. Love, love, love. Takano? Hmm? Huh? Karada? What's going on? L let go. T t no, I, I love you. Huh? What? Um, so, I love you. I love you, Takano. Whoa. Wow. T talk it. You creep. Huh? Uh, I'm sorry. Why? I thought you accepted me. Why? But why? Um, look, I'm really sorry. I wasn't getting close to you with, you know, that kind of intention. I just felt bad for you, Karada. Oh, no. Sorry, it's nothing. We should stop meeting here, okay? Huh? No, 
no, no. Why? Why? Why won't anyone accept me? Uh-oh. Yep. Why? Why won't anyone accept me? Karata, stop. Why? Why? Somebody help. Karata, what are you doing? He's having a mental breakdown. No one accepts me. No one. Yeah, you shouldn't be friends with someone just because you feel bad for them. It's kind of fucked up, honestly. You think I'm disgusting too, don't you? What? I'm um, kinda don't want- I wanna- mm, Okay, no, this isn't creepy. This is fine. I'm freaked out. I don't like it. Run, run, run. I'm <laughs> being followed by something gross. I can feel it. No! 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 Or he's stabbing someone, but I don't like it. Wow, it's just him stabbing this eye out over and over again. Again, prepare thyself for fucked upness. This game is dark. Hey, could you stop that, maybe? I would pre Why? Why does no one accept me? Why? 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 Teacher. Uh, I don't think he knows you're there. My face. I thought if I changed my face, that would change too. And yes, things did change. It was a complete turnaround. Everyone welcomed me. I was accepted by others at last. I was happy, but... I soon realized it wasn't me who people were welcome to. What? <laughs> it was this face. No one looked inside me. It was always... Always my appearance. This fabricated face. This isn't me. It's not me who was loved. Just this fake face. I've never been loved for... I've never been loved for me. That's not true, teacher. Hi. You didn't, didn't realize I was standing here. What's going on? Everyone always said that Mr. Karata is a kind and reliable teacher. Everyone? Besides, I know it myself that you really are kind at heart, Mr. Karata, as much as things went astray. And that I can appreciate, except for the stabbing. I can't quite get over the stabbing. What? So please, sir, don't be sad anymore. Me and everyone, we all love that kind teacher of ours. <laughs> Aww, I feel bad for Karata, but he did kill somebody, so... Well... He's free. What's this? What is this? There's something on the ground. Uh, yes, I'm gonna touch it. I'm gonna touch everything in here. This is Ayaka's hairpin. Oh, it's, uh... The, the girl that was obsessed. Is that me and Ayaka? Ayaka, that really couldn't matter less. Let's get somewhere safe. No way, not until I see it all. And I haven't even looked in the bottom drawer. You can pass up the opportunity, but I won't. Don't say I didn't warn you. Oh, that's right. All right, time to take out the lower drawer. What have we here? Hmm, it's that sedative, isn't it? Whoa. Ah, what are these arms? Oh, it's the hands. In Mr. Karata's desk? Why w Are these real? No. C can't be. Uh, why are you looking at my hands? Don't touch that. Whoa. Yeah. Good. Still not rotten. Your body truly is miraculous to stay fresh for over three months. All the more to love. That's gross. Hmm. <laughs> this guy's nuts! And you, you saw my secret. No, I, w I didn't. No, I didn't. You can't escape. <laughs> I'm coming to get you, Ayaka. Gross. I got you. There's no running away now. Oh, so that's what was happening when I walked in. About earlier, you won't tell anyone, will you? It's a secret between us. No, no, no! I see. That's unfortunate. Then I'll have to kill you. Then I was like, what up? Ayaka and Mr. Karada. Ah, uh, help. Ayaka? Calm down. The monsters are gone, Ayaka. What happened to Ayaka? She's in a panic after being attacked by a monster. No, don't let him fool you. He was trying to kill me. You were attacked, Ayaka? See, I told you to escape somewhere safe. Hold on. She should stay here and rest. But, 
Don't worry, I'll be with her. All right, I'll leave Ayaka to you, sir. I'll keep looking around. Huh? No, wait, wait, don't go. Wait a moment. I think I have a tranquilizer on my desk in the faculty room. Could you bring it to me? It may help her calm down a little. Understood. Be careful. Don't you dare die out there. After all, you're one of my dear students. Don't let him trick you like this. Sir, thank you very much. Wait, Teague, don't go. Help me, please. Now then, no one to get in the way. No. Oh, so my legs are too weak to run. They're not too weak to crawl, though. Think you can get away from me? Help. Oh, here comes another stabbing. Wow. Idiot girl. Hmm. I'd be suspicious if only I was unhurt. He stabbed himself too. He's really good at this stabbing thing. Did I just say that? <laughs> I, I just said that. Well. So, Mr. Karada killed Ayaka. I'm so sorry I didn't notice Ayaka. I wouldn't really say that was your fault. Uh, there are babies. Babies. Okay, now I'm gonna do this. What, I don't have the mirror now? Toma's grave. Uh, yes. I just wanna see what happens. I don't think I have the mirror. Or do I? I don't know. Let's find out. Ma da da da. You can't just have Toma. Rude. I can't be your boyfriend because I don't feel that way about you. To I just love that Toma is just like, oh god. Oh, okay, so I do still have the mirror. Alright. So I think we can go ahead and fast forward through this. I was just curious as to what was going on. Um, because before when I tried to go over to uh, Karada's grave, at the very beginning it was like, oh, you don't want to do that right now. And I'm like, okay. Go on. Oh, I have to walk over and talk to her. That's right. Oh, it's okay. It's all right that you're a corpse. Lots of people who like corpses. The guy from Corpse Bride. Some gross people. We can be friends. I can be friends with a corpse. It's no, it's no biggie smalls. You're my friend, Miss Ayal. Don't be upset. Aw. Poor girl. I feel really bad for her. There we go. She's back to normal. No more corpse face for you. Aww. So sweet. Alright. Good. I'm glad that I got the truth ending. I know what happened with everyone and why they were all bitches. It's, it's kind of fucking messed up though that uh... <laughs> Toma's stuck in the other world now to help raise babies. <laughs> That's like the most fucked up shit ever. Toma's like, hey, you left me. <laughs> it's like, sorry, man. I didn't mean to. So, yeah, guys, there we go. That was Miss Ayao. That game was awesome. I really liked it. Uh, thank you, Patricia, for buying it for me. It was a lot of fun. I really enjoyed it. <sighs> it's funny, he <laughs> brings freaking oh, so now like she's all obsessed with Onigawara. Like Karada's dead, so now she's like, oh my god, it's an anthropomorphic demon with no hair and an awesome personality. And Vugan Tome is like I don't wanna raise babies. Look. <laughs> He's looking at that baby like, get the fuck away from me. Don't touch me. I don't like you. Aw, oh, man. I feel bad for Teague, though. He's all alone now. Everyone's dead. All his friends are dead. But that was a great game, so... Thank you guys for coming in and, and watching um, Miss I Out with me and setting through all this craziness uh, for me to get the true ending. I'm really happy with it. We've actually freed Miss I Out. She's no longer an angry spirit, and she can move on instead of holding on to her anger and rage and... Uh, resentment and stuff so I'm really happy about that that was a lot of fun um yeah 
I'm, I'm super excited that I actually freaking beat it and I made her happy. That makes me happy. So uh, I love you guys and I will see you over at um, Sticks Master of Shadows, Metal Gear Solid 5, and hopefully I'll get to some Witcher today. But if not, then the next time. So I love you guys and I will see you in a bit at the other games. All right. Bye.